Turning to matters pertaining to national defense now, South Korea's Navy has been conducting a large-scale exercise that covers all costs of the peninsula. It's part of efforts to better counter North Korean threats at sea. Kim Hyun-bin takes us to the thick of that action. A group of destroyers is patrolling the West Sea when a radar signal detects enemy warships from afar. In a split second, the South Korean warships spring into battle formation. A group of Lynx anti-submarine helicopters is also deployed to help search for underwater threats. Once the enemy submarines are detected, the helicopter drops a death bomb, nearly sinking the subs. The destroyers also fire on a group of North Korean patrol ships crossing the maritime border, known as the Northern Limit Line. The targets are hit and the enemy patrol ships are sunk. This is all part of South Korean Navy's annual New Year's exercise, conducted to better counter North Korea's naval threats. Several destroyers, helicopters and P-3 surveillance planes took part in the drills, which were held on all coasts of the peninsula. We are conducting regular naval exercises to better counter all different types of scenarios. If the enemy launches a provocation, we'll bury them beneath the sea and secure our maritime border and all coasts. The chief of naval operations, Ahm Hyun Sung, was also present at the drill, aboard a P-3 surveillance plane, sending direct orders to the troops and evaluating the Navy's defense readiness. Kim Hyun-bin, Arirang News.